Welcome to another new episode, guys. Inside an open hard disk drive is a nice shiny round object that looks like a mirror. And this is used as the computer's permanent memory store. It is a special type of CD known as compact disk. It's not like many of us computer users haven't faced hard disk drive problems at some point or the other. If the hard disk drive is not working, then the computer cannot be turned on. Many times, if the logic board or motherboard of the hard disk drive is damaged, it does not read and write data. And if the CD or compact disk inside is damaged, the hard disk drive cannot be reused. However, most hard disk drives are recoverable if the logic board malfunctions by self-examination. Today, I will show some tricks on how to recycle a damaged hard disk drive. To fix a damaged hard disk drive, you will need a good pencil eraser, a piece of zero sandpaper, a torque screwdriver, a little soft cloth, soldering paste and a soldering iron. I took a 320 GB hard disk drive. Unscrewing all the screws of the hard disk drive with the correct size torque screwdriver. Bits after removing all the screws I took out. The logic board. Now you can see the hard disk drive logic board connector. This connector has a number of pins that communicate the operation process and data read and write information. Now look. It is the connector of the motor which follows the command and moves the hard disk drive CD by controlled rotation. A brushless motor is attached to control the rotation. Now I will open another one terabyte problematic hard disk drive. Remove all screws as before. After opening the logic board, we can see the logic board and motor connectors. Hard disk drive connectors are usually designed depending on the different company and hard disk drive model or production. Similarly, the logic board and hard disk drive is also different. This design mainly depends on the company, size, speed, etc. Now I will show how to reuse the logic board of a hard disk drive. First, I will show a process. In this process, the connecting layouts of the logic board should be well rubbed with a pencil eraser. Moisture falls on the connecting layout of the logic board, resulting in obstruction of data transmission or reception. In this way, the data connecting and motor connecting layouts have to be done step by step. Now all the connecting pins of hard disk drive should be rubbed with light pressure with zero sandpaper. Then clean the rubbed part and the entire logic board with a soft cloth or brush. It is better to thoroughly dry the entire logic board using thinner. Now I am cleaning the second hard disk drive as before. It is better to carefully pry the connecting pins up with very little force.
After the above work is done, check the hard disk drive again by setting it up on the computer. Now I will show you how to repair hard disk drive in second step. First I clean the connecting layout of the logic board with a light scrub. Now I am coating each connecting point of the layout with soldering paste. After coating all the connecting points of the layout with soldering paste, fasten all the screws of the hard disk drive. Now the hard disk drive should be installed on the computer. Hopefully this process will make your dead hard disk drive usable again. How is the video and how to make it better? You can write your opinion in the comments section. I hope you liked this video. If you like this video, don't forget to press like button and share to your friends. Stay tuned by subscribing to my channel and press the bell button to get the next video.